Let us watch this video. You will see the military police. Yachima is talking to terrorists. Terrorists gave the money to military police. Military police transferred the money to Tinubu. And Tinubu now gave the money to the terrorists. And terrorists put the money in his pocket. Good. Wonderful. Wonderful and wonderful. I hope every one of you understand what really played in this video that we just finished watching. And I hope every one of you understand the point. And believe you me, you can never dispute it. You cannot dispute it. You will always agree with me that Nigeria is a fraud bench. This is what they call bribing and corruption. Bribing and corruption. And I hope every one of you pay very big attentively to see how that money goes. It was not from the front, at the back. That is what they call bribery and corruption. They are now paying the terrorists to go out there and do what they know how to do best. Now you are getting the point. Lend me your ears and pay very big attentively. Because I want to tell my people something they want to know. Every of you, every indigenous people find themselves in that contraption. Listen very careful. Nobody can fix that contraption. Nobody can fix Nigeria. You know why? I will tell you. Listen very well. And you will understand everything that is coming out from my mouth. And you can never challenge it. Believe you me, you can't. Except you lack ability to reason. Then you will begin to argue. Nigeria is a fraudulent. The foundation of Nigeria was built on fraud. The amalgamation of Rugard 1914 was fraud. Begin to ask this question. Was your grandfather there when the Amaga made us together? The answer is no. Was your grandmother there? The answer is no. And do you know that even though the Amaga mission have expired 2014 by regard? You see, I want you people to know the reason why you are seeing all these shenanigans every single day. First, we are not one people. That is the reason why they amalgamate us together in the first place. And you have to understand this. We are like oil and water. And we all know that these two things can never be mixed together. Now you understand. And because we are not one people, because the foundation of Nigeria was built on fraud, the bribery and corruption, killings and maimings, terrorists killing every day, raping and adoption of our people will continue. I have told my people about the movement of jihadism. And they are coming with ethnic cleansing. It does not matter who you are. If you don't believe in that jihadism, you are their enemy. The Fulanese can never stop on this, their conquest called Holy War. And do you know why they call it Holy War? Because they said it's a fight that they must carry and they must conquer. Now you understand. Let me introduce myself before I go more further, go in details on this video that we just finished watching because I want to talk to some people. All right, wonderful people, great people, freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, great people all over the world. You are welcome once again on IPOB Rapture Media under the leadership of Mazin Nandi Okukano. Here, we set the record straight. 
My name is Mazu Okinna Okichuku, known as the Biafran Child in Watch Nigeria. The general. Now pay attention. The corruption in Nigeria can never stop. That is why I will keep on shouting, telling the indigenous people that find themselves in that contraption to buckle their belts and stand on disintegration of that contraption called Damini Buzu. Except that the killing will continue. Terrorists will keep on trooping and occupying your territories. They will keep on intimidating you people. They will keep on adopting and raping of your people without stopping. I'm not lying. Because what we just see now is the root of all this problem. It did not start today. This thing that Shetima and military police and Tinubu and the terrorists displayed did not start today. It had been there for a long time because the foundation of Nigeria was built on fraud. The way they structure us, the way they structure people they, that they find themselves in Africa is that bribery, corruption, killings. If you are not involved, you can never get to that position. And now to the citizens. They structure the citizens by hunger and poverty. And you know that somebody that is hungry is a deadly person. And they are now ready to receive the money to do whatever you tell them to do. That is why they have already you know, structured everything, put some people in, a, in the place. Now the citizens will be now fighting to kill each other. Nigeria can never be fixed. You know why? Because God did not put Nigeria together. God, we call Shuku Kikabiyama, did not create Nigeria. Nigeria was a man-made or Nigeria is a man-made because Nigeria was put together and created by British people, not by God. That is why you see God can never bless Nigeria because God bless only things that he put together. Now you understand. I don't even know if our people are getting this point. You see, if you don't know, you don't know. And I have some advice for P2P and obedient people. I have heard obedient time with that number saying that it's not going to give shishi. But my question to you, Obi, now is, are you ready to get to that seat? Now they have started the bribery and corruption. And I tell those people that be able to caption this because there are some people that they have tired seeing all these shenanigans, displaying every single day. Kudos to you, those that, you know, be able to caption this, hitting the camera and caption it. Kudos to you all. Obedience you are seeing by yourself. That is why I keep on telling you, go back and get your ass seated. Think about your own people. Forget about this contraption because you, if, even though you get there, you cannot fix anything. And believe you me, there is no chance that you will get there. Because there's adage in our place said, The structure of that contraption, I'm telling you, I'm not telling you in reality, in Western world, it was not like that. But in that contraption, this is the way they structure it. The person that has the money, people follows. That is how they structure it. So I want you to also understand that. That is where we find ourselves. That is why we are doing all our best to make sure that the bacchanalization of that contraption come to pass. So that people will live 
as a woman and always obey the law of the land. Just imagine Mazin Namdekanu have been discharged by appeal court, but some people are still holding him. I want you people to keep on, you know, thinking about all these things. Believe you me, you can never, you can never disagree with me. And I want you people to know that this is how the government of Tinubu will be when he will get to that seat. I've said it, Tinubu will legalize drugs in that contraption. And most of our people will turn to junkie. Because you know why? That is how he made all his money. I want you to see what is happening. Paying the terrorist in open place. And in, do you know how this action uh, 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 take place? That they did not give the money in the, from the front, but at the back. That to show you that this is a real bribery and corruption. The order of the day in that contraption. Now you understand. Good day.